Happy Saturday, everybody. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a full case break of 2019 Tops Finest Baseball. This is Pick Your Team number nine. We sold it out straight up. So thanks, everybody, for making that happen on the 8th, Saturday. Pick Your Team nine. Ryan Redmond, Last Bot Mojo, Baltimore Orioles. And thanks, everybody, who helped knock this break out. Really appreciate it. There is the fresh case right here. Good luck, everybody. Two autographs per box. <coughs> Excuse me, eight box break. So we've got two right here, four. Six, seven, and eight right here. Obviously, this year featuring this guy. I haven't seen that guy yet. Good luck, everybody. Good luck, good luck, good luck. I think the autograph's usually in this pack right here, so we're gonna slide that to the back. Just to maximize suspense. All right, let's see what we got today. Scores-wise, ladies and gentlemen, score update. I'll give you final scores here. Tampa Bay Rays up in Boston beat the Red Sox 9-2. Rangers beat the A's 10-5. White Sox shot out the Royals 2-0. I was on the, had financial interest in the Royals. Didn't happen today. Uh, Diamondbacks shut out the Blue Jays 6-0. Phillies beat the Reds 4-1. And uh, the Indians seem like they're starting to heat up a little bit. They beat the uh, Yankees 8-4. to four. And the Orioles beat the Astros 4-1. to one. I think there should be a couple other final scores, I think. Yeah, Tigers beat the Twins 9-3. Atlanta shut out the Marlins 1-0. And the uh, the Brew Crew getting back on track five to three over the Pirates in Milwaukee. All right. Good luck, everybody. Box number one. We got JD Martinez at two fifty. I'll set those aside. We'll have those sleeved and top loaded later on. Let's get Michael Franco into focus. There we go. Starlin Castro to 150 for the uh, White Sox. And Jose Martinez is your first autograph for the Cardinals. That goes to Andrew Herman. There you go. Nice refractor autograph. Your next autograph is, where is it? Oh, there it is. It's Williams Astudio, 22 out of 25 orange autograph. Rookie auto for the Twins. John Alfie's with the Twins. I think he might have gotten sent down for a little bit to the minors to work some things out. I don't know if he'll be back soon. Love those orange parallels. All right, next box.
All right, we got games in progress. The bottom of the sixth. Oh, yeah, the double header. Bottom of the sixth, Boston now leading the Rays 5-1. to one. There's another double header. I think the Rangers, Oakland, another double header. Um, in the top of the fourth, the Cardinals have a narrow one, a uh, four to three lead, one run lead, on the Cubbies. I've got financial interest on the Cubs, so I hope the Cubs make a comeback. Still early, going into the bottom of the fourth now, so still early. Rockies and Mets are tied at three at the end of the fourth. I'm on the Rockies tonight. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm losing my voice already. Uh, Giants leading my Dodgers 2-1 to one at the end of the fourth. So still a lot of time there. And then three late games. We've got the second game of the doubleheader. Oakland at Texas. Seattle is here in Anaheim. Playing the, the Angels. The Los Angeles, California Angels of Anaheim. And the Nationals are in San Diego. All right. Good luck, everyone. And we've got a gold Juan Soto. Three out of 50. Nice. That goes to Hewdy, David Hewton with that. And we got Rowdy Rowdy Tellez. 67 out of 150. I like the blue parallel for a blue team. Blue Jays. Robert G. Picked up the Blue Jays. Thanks, Robert. First one for you. There's Jake Bowers to 250. And we've got Brandon Lau. Nice. Nice Brandon Lau autograph for Nick Stanley and the Rays. He's been having a great season. All right, next one. Good luck, everybody. Nick Pavetta had a complete game. It's pretty good. Rays prospect Brent Honeywell out for the season. And Lucas Giolito, yeah, definitely emerging. He's one of the Major League's best pitchers. He was... Uh, Ooh, there's a redemption on the bottom there. He was um, such a highly touted prospect for the Nationals for so long, but he was called up a couple times, sent back down, called up, just with, did not look very good. Did not look good when he was traded to the uh, to the White Sox. And only just this season has he started to really start. He's 9-1. and one. He's got a 9-1 and one record. He went 7-2 and two thirds, gave up only three hits, zero earned runs, 11 strikeouts, and only two walks. And he's sporting a, uh, a 228 ERA right now. It's pretty awesome. So dust off those old Lucas Giolito rookie cards. He's starting to he's starting to come good on the uh, he was like number one prospect for a lot of lists. Baseball America, MLB Pipeline. There he is right there. So I guess blo blooming a little late. There's Michael Kopech. To 99 for the White Sox. That'll be for Luke Smith. 
We got a gold Kevin Kramer to 50. And there's Miguel Andujar. Nice. Finest Origins autograph for AJ Anderson and the Bronx Bombers. So a nice one. G, G leader in the worst division, though. Well, where, where did his wins come from? He beat the Yankees, Indians, Toronto, Toronto, Houston, Kansas City, Cleveland, Kansas City. All right, so yeah. But still, 228 ERA. There's Danny Jansen. 11 strikeouts, two walks. That helps in your fantasy leagues. You're welcome, AJ. Let's see what this redemption is all about. Eric Hosmer is going to reveal a finest autograph, no parallel, of M A T. Matthew, Matt, Chapman, A's. That's going to be for Jason Bell. I think all the Mariano autographs are alive. Matt Chapman has been the has been the redemption almost all the time. Box. I'm watching a uh, X Men Days of Future Past or whatever. Is that a good one? They're living in the mansion. I, this is when like there was young Professor Xavier, young Xavier. Did they always live in that mansion? Where that mansion come from? Next box. It's on TNT or some T something. A Turner Network. Okay, that was. I think it was. That was a good one, right? Days of Future Past or whatever. And there's Chris Shaw for the Giants. Robert Edwards. At a 99 green wave. That's right. Yeah, J Law's in there. She's easy on the eyes. It's Chris Shaw, Oppo Joe Mojo. I feel like there's too many, too many X Men movies. Some of them not very good. That Dark Phoenix doesn't, one doesn't, doesn't look good. It looks like a CW show. So CUK saying that's the Professor's Mansion. They have the young and old in this one. So did Xavier always have that mansion? I don't remember. I don't remember that storyline. Uh, there's Kristen Stewart to 50. That goes to the, uh, Jeremy Mendel and the Tigers. And your autograph is Corbin Burns for the Brew Crew. 
Austin Caruso with the Brewers. So there are your two autos there. Oh, it's his family estate. I see, I see. Okay, that makes sense. So even before, so even before they had uh, officially developed the school, he had like Wolverine living there. I guess I should just go and watch the movie again. <laughs> Notorious, what's going on? Gilo is like, Jennifer Lawrence is half naked in this movie, and I'm worried about the real estate. I've seen plenty of Jennifer Lawrence. I moved on for that. I know what she looks like. I remember it very clearly. It's crystal in my head. The real estate, that uh, that is not crystal in my head. I know, I, I'm just going to rent the movie again. Too, okay? <laughs> Figure it out. Uh, this is box four, yes. Or five. Five, six, seven, eight. Five. This is box five. The Wolverine was, movie was pretty good, right? The most recent one? Where he's like old and aging and his regenerative powers aren't as strong and there's like, there's like little, little kid Wolverine and she's like insane. I think that was a pretty good one. All right, let's find some pretty good hits in here. There's Carlos Correa to 150. Wait, is there time traveling in this movie? Maybe that's where. It... Let's figure it out. Maybe Wolverine goes back in time. Luke Voigt, seven out of fifty. Gold autograph for A.J. Anderson. Luke Voigt has been uh, has been hitting the homers. Oh, is it called Logan? Maybe it's not Wolverine. It's called. See, I can't keep track of all these X Men movies. It's too many. Whatever that recent one was, where like Professor X is like in the throes of dementia and stuff, and Starling Castro two hundred and fifty. I thought that he, not 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 even as an X Men movie. I just thought it was a good a good picture just in general, just on its own. Like good writing, good acting. And we've got Tuki Toussaint for Jonathan Kent and the Braves. Big strikeout guy here. Just needs to get those walks under control and could be a very uh, could be a solid starter for the Bravos. All right, three boxes to go. Stephen K likes the X Men First Class with Kevin Bacon in it. That's when they first introduced the like the James McAvoy Jennifer Lawrence ones, right? And Fastbender. These are kids. Are they making one more X Men movie with this current cast? I think so, right? Is that the Cuban Missile Crisis one? They all blur together.
Okay, I, yeah, I like that one too. The Cuban Missile Crisis one was good. All right, there's Toussaint again. And we got Michael Kopech, nice rookie auto for the White Sox. Luke Smith with the Southsiders. Yeah, that Luke Voigt's pretty nice, AJ Anderson. Luke Voigt's having a nice season. Nice low number, too. Nice parallel gold. Nice Michael Kopech. And there's Mario Rivera, finest careers die cut. Some of these can be autographed. They're very short printed, but they can be autographed. That's what we're looking for. Josh Hader to 250. And your auto is Francisco Arcia for the Angels. Dwayne with the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim of California. Final two boxes. Good luck, everybody. Four autographs to go. One in each mini box. Oh, the Cubs have tied the ball game. It's 4-4. Four, four. I have financial interest. I've made an investment in the Cubs today. I also have an investment, a financial investment in the Rockies. They're also tied up, so I'm going to sweat out those two games. Um... It's like playing the stock market. Yeah, where, where's all those Rhino Hearns? There's usually like a one per case Rhino Hearn, right? Good luck, everybody. There's Javier Baez to 250. And we have Jose Martinez to 150, another Cardinal for Andrew Herman. There's Kirsch to 150. Joey Gallo, Refractor, Will Myers coming into focus. And it's Tory Hunter for the Twins. John Alfie's with Tory Hunter. Nice old school auto.
And the final box, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck, AJ Anderson. No, the Yankees did not let you down. I'm still, ho I'm still holding out hope for this guy. That would be a really nice cherry on top. But the Andujar and the Luke Voigt, pretty nice. There's some rumors, MLB rumors here. Yankees going for Madison Bumgarner? Could be interesting. Should the Tigers trade Matt Boyd? It's one of their better pitchers, though, isn't it? Could the Rays explore a trade for closer Brad Hand? It's a possibility. Think Trevor Bauer gets moved? You think Scherzer is moved? Who knows? <laughs> yeah. That was one of my better randomizer videos, Mr. Mike's Daddy. All right, good luck, folks. Two more autographs to go in this one. Thank you for the fill. I think we have some more finest cases, so keep your eye out for the next one. And if you miss out on your teams the first time, do not miss out the next time. All right, good luck, everyone. And it's Danny Jansen for the Blue Jays. 88 out of 99. That'll be for Robert and the Bluebirds. And the last autograph coming up. Good luck, everyone. Another die cut, Mario Rivera die cut. And Yachty to 99. And the last autograph is going to be Alex Bregman. Nice. That's a good way to close out the break. That's for Jason. Bell, who picked up the Astros. Alex Bregman autograph to close things out at the very, very end. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. No randomizer to do. Pretty solid way to end the break. Thank you very much, everyone. That was finest, uh, the brand new 2019 Tops Finest Baseball. Pick your team, number nine, from jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time for more.